Hey, I didn't know if you wanted to watch paint dry or watch my reflection video or maybe listen to some MF Doom. So I put it all together into one. Um, we spent our time creating a welcoming environment and student engagement was our priority. Uh, our risk was accepting student identity decisions like gender pronouns, name changes, that kind of thing. We're getting that more and more. Um, we tried to approach this with the filter of what is our job and we teach. We don't need to judge. We just need to teach like and we need to help them toward the next class, toward the next learning environment. Um, as soon as we argue with students, we lose them and we really want them engaged in our classes. My human capital is making connections and helping kids feel valued. And that's what I brought to our team. And I think our team did a great job. Like our team decided on ways that we can encourage teachers to accept students as they are. If a student wants to come in and be called Star-Lord, it's a pretty lame superhero name, but I'm okay with that. As long as they're still doing math in my class or creative writing, I struggle with the unconventional pronouns, but there are non-confrontational ways around that. And so those are some of the things that we worked with in creating our top 10 list that hopefully will help you. Um, my big takeaway is that we need to help our community understand differences and interact in non-confrontational ways. That's how we can make progress. Um, the big metaphor with the canvas and the paint and MF Doom, I don't know, are the kids the canvas and the paint is our content and we're just throwing it on there and seeing what sticks and seeing what dries? I don't know. Um, are we the canvas and the kids are being dumped on us and we get to create community with whatever comes our way? I need to pause that. Sorry, the paint dried too fast. Um, whoa, my video's not working. Sorry, the paint dried too fast. And um, I guess the main point is like, would that video have been any different if it was in black and white? If it's in black and white, are we still creating community? Are we still like, I don't know. There's no metaphor there that I really like. Hopefully our top 10 list helps you have a good year next year. That's about as far as I got. All right. Thanks for watching.